I'm not like too, too concerned. I love trying things out and I love seeing if they'll work. Wow. Uh, you've been there for a while, Boldorb. I appreciate the enthusiasm. Howdy ho, Peglineers. We're back with some more. This is another challenge. This one is from Anthony Ism. And they're just asking for a different ball uh, sized ball challenge. So we, um, we initially they were said to have start with three terror balls and three bold orbs, but I figured that this would be just as good. Um, it'd be a little bit more balanced. So I went ahead and just swapped it out and now we're doing this instead. So hopefully, uh, hopefully they all don't mind. But anyways, beyond that, hope you guys are having a fantastic day. And if you guys aren't, hopefully your day turns around. Every day is a new day, so. Hopefully uh, today is a better day. Now I'm gonna try my best not to skip any um, skip any uh, orbs. Yeah, I'm trying my best not to skip any orbs here. I think it's only fair that I don't that I try not to skip any orbs. Um, that being said, though, obviously I will definitely be uh, um, getting relics and whatnot as I go, so no need to worry there. Okay, we definitely are going to go for the double chest into a single fight. So let's do that hard right. Here we come. Anyways, hope you guys are having a fantastic day. And if you guys aren't, hopefully your day turns around. And uh, if you guys... Ooh. Uh, let's remove a Terra Ball. Uh, if we, at some point, if we can, we'll try to get that Terra Ball back. Um, it's one of those things where it's like, okay, well, I want to make sure I kind of stay relevant to the challenge. So... Try to make it uh try to make it even if we if at all possible. I really don't want either of these, but I'm actually curious because I can't remember. I'm gonna try the grabby end. I don't think the grabby end works at all with the bulldog, but I'm just kind of curious. You know, curiosity kills the cat. Any hoosers, any hoosers. If you guys haven't had something to drink, guys, let me just tell you, you need to stay hydrated. Oh no, I'm sad. I'm actually really sad. I can't, I can't grab anything. This would have been a great opportunity to grab an Eye of Turtle. That would have been so good. Okay, well, unfortunate, but it is what it is. Let's go left because left will equate to, if even if I accidentally go the wrong way, I'll end up going to at least something that gives me a relic. And that's definitely what I'm looking for. Alrighty. Um, out of curiosity, I want to try this. I don't think it's going to work. I just can't remember. It's been a long time, kind of, so... I'm just curious. Let's see. Okay, well, never mind. I didn't get a C. I lied. I did not get to see. Um, you know what? I know that I won't be getting this opportunity for a bit, so I'm just gonna go and upgrade. And um, yeah, we do want to go right, so this all worked out. I did not get half as many coins as I would have liked to have gotten, but that's okay though. Not the end of the world. Navigation inflation doesn't sound too bad, and the ambidextrous doesn't sound too bad either. I think I'm gonna go for the um. Navigation inflation. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go for that. Oh my gosh. Oh my, what is this board? What is this board, guys? Got a little strip here. And uh, yeah, okay. I mean, I could still go hard left, get both of these. Um, I don't know if I'll, I don't know if that's what I wanna do though. Well, I guess we'll find out here. Let's we'll see how many coins we end up getting. Alrighty, can we get a crit anywhere? No, we cannot get a crit. What if I like toss it here in the middle? Maybe like it magically. There we go. Yeah. I think we just killed them all. Yeah, we did. Beautiful. Okay, let's start saving money. Duplication potion. I love it. I love that idea already. Um, Shrewd scales is pretty nice too. I think duplication potion is going to be really nice. I think it's going to be really scalable. Definitely going to go hard left here and try to get just as many coins as I can. Um, there you go. That was a decent amount of coins. We need to have coins. We need to go to a shop and almost guarantee that we can get something. Uh, let's go for the refresh shield. So yeah, we're gonna go hard left and we're gonna see if, uh, if we have a comfortable amount of money to go to the shop, which I think we will. From what I'm seeing, I think we will. Um, I'm not like too, too concerned. So fingers crossed that that is what it is, you know? Go right in here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I can't even hit them. You know, it was a good test anyways, though. We're getting the bombs, okay? That's what's going on. Also, we do have the refillibuster. That was the first relic we got. The relics we were supposed to start off with were the well done stake, knife's edge, monster training, and wanna's ultimate power. That's why we're taking a little bit of damage as we go, um, which is totally fine. Not a big deal. Ooh, that was not as good as it could have been. 
definitely gonna be skipping here because there's nothing there's no reason not to skip here we have to use this to deal damage kind of i mean not necessarily only have to but kind of so we're doing our best here to hopefully make it pan out i need to get a refresh let's go deep left see if we get a refresh over there and yes we are taking a lot of damage there's not a whole heck of a lot that i can do about it unfortunately okay well crit yes crit no i'm crying it's all right we might go down here and get something there we go we got him we got him okay 121 not bad i think we go yeah i think we go left i mean even if i go left i can still choose to go right but left is kind of the safer bet so let's do that <laughs> all righty Ooh, okay. This is a spicy one. I shouldn't have to worry too much about this. Oh, wow. We went, like, almost perfectly straight up and down. Okay. A little bit unfortunate how that all panned out. That's all right, though. That is all right. Anyways, let me tell you a little bit about my day, guys. And if you guys have something interesting you want to share, leave a comment. Let me know. I'm always curious to see how your guys' days are going. Some of you guys are getting done with your finals and your tests and stuff. It's really exciting. Um, hopefully you guys are all passing them and you did well on your semester and you're going to be ready and refreshed for the upcoming semester. But um, that being said, so far today, my day has been overall pretty good. I have 170 coins. Ooh, that's really good. It shows, shows the shoot scales. Shoot scales give this extra damage, which I'm kind of all about. I'm going to go for the shoot scales because we only have one terror ball right now. So it's kind of like, well, kind of just works out. Anyways, any hoosers. Um, so today, you know, I was a little bit sluggish to get up. I'll be honest. I was a little bit sluggish to get up. Okay. We definitely want Eye of Turtle. Eye of Turtle gives us an extra Orb of Relic whenever we uh, offer them pretty much. That being said, I'm not sure if I really want anything else. Um, bombs are nice, but I'm not going for a bomb run. Fresh Bandana is cool, but I mean, do I really need another refresh? I have the refresh shield and I only have three orbs. So kind of irrelevant. Brown guard's actually pretty nice. I'll actually, I'll pick that up. And then we're going to leave and go to the next one and see if there's a relic here that we want over any of those. I definitely think either the cookie or the molten gold. Um, considering our health is almost half, I think the cookie is definitely what we're getting. So we can stay alive. But anyways, yeah. So today I woke up a little bit late. Um, I kind of just didn't want to get up. Lately, I've been in this weird mood where I'm not really, I haven't really been a super big fan of getting up. You know, I've been tired. I've just been wanted to stay in bed. And I know you guys have probably been there with me at some point. And that's really fine. You know, sometimes you have your, your struggling moments, your moments where you just don't really want to get up, where you're not feeling things, where you're just, you know, tired. And that's life. Sometimes that's just how things happen. And uh, we just kind of have to deal with it, you know, accept it. But um, if you guys have any tips or tricks about days where you don't want to get up and you're just tired and you want to stay in bed, leave a comment. Let me know. I'm curious. I'm curious. Uh, I really want to grab this so I can do a run with it in the future. Can target any, any enemy. Um, gold collected from hit gold pegs contribute an additional one times damage. I'm going to go and just snag it so it can be my like toss away orb at some point. And that's really it. Let's see. Hmm. <laughs> I think uh, what everyone would probably say is the most damage is gift that keeps on giving. I don't think anyone would argue that gift that keeps on giving is not the most damage. So I'm kind of down to pick it up. That being said, I just I kind of like just other stuff. I like being quirky and, and weird in some cases. So in some ways, I'm like, yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, maybe Ooh, the left side was juicy. The right side is juicy. Upper right is juicy. Bottom left is juicy. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can get that, that crit there. I it just I just snuck snake it snuck it through, snuck it snaked it through. Um, that's that's uh yeah that happens okay. There we go. This should be pretty good damage regardless of how crazy this goes or not. So I'm fine with it. And uh, yeah, luckily I think we're gonna actually end up killing this guy, killing these guys. Yeah, I'm actually surprised the Terror Ball got through so unscathed. I'm actually really surprised about that. I'm gonna go and just skip this. Uh, I didn't really mean to take it in the sense of I'm taking it. I'm really meant to take it in the sense of I'm taking it so that I can have it. 
Alrighty, there we go. There we go. There's the crits. If we if we're lucky, we get a crit stall on those fleas. That'll give us some some wild things as well. Okay. Uh, we have 90 coins. Do we have a shop coming up? We do have a shop coming up a little bit later. I think we can hold off for a while and try our best to not worry about that. Let's go right in there. So this gives us an extra two relics, extra three relics even if we if we can go the right way. Bombaton for sure. This game has been offering me bombatons left, right, willy nilly. It's been going bonkers. It's like, yo, you want this? Oh, you got it, homie. And I'm like, okay, I guess I'll take it. Ha ha ha, smiley face. <laughs> so yeah, you know, kind of works out. I do think the uh, Wanda Skultimate Power would have been an amazing addition. Sorry, not Wanda Skultimate Power. That's what we already have. Overwhammer would have been an amazing addition to this build. Um, I was a little bit worried about the damage. It was actually not really the damage. I was really worried about the, uh, um, about skipping the uh, Terror Ball. And I was a little bit worried about the damage being taken. But I think now that we have a couple things that kind of help with it a little bit, I think we'll be all right. Uh, it's not perfect by any means, but I think we'll be all right. Okay, this is where things get really interesting. I'm going to try like a little bit of a trick shot, and I'm going to try to bounce it off this little thing here in the bottom left, bounce it to the right, and get it in. Bada bing, bada boom. Also, guys, what's it called? Someone that helped me get over 1,000 subs is about to get to 1,000 subs themselves. And that being said, um, I think we can help. Um, the channel is called Cam Wen, and the description will be in the link. Well, a link will be in the description section below. Please go and subscribe to them and, um, you know, just help them get over that 1K mark. You don't have to say anything. Just, you know, make it a random, nice little surprise. That would help me out a bunch. I'd be very grateful if you guys did that. Wow, we just got lucky, super lucky there. I'd be really grateful if you guys did that because I'm always about paying things forward, paying things back. And uh, I think that would be a really nice thing. So yeah, if you guys, uh, if you guys feel like being generous, um, uh, just go look at the link in the description and go, go, uh, go subscribe to that man's. All right, we're gonna go to the right here. I like this. This is pretty good. Also, I totally lost my train of thought. I think I had something going and now I just don't, which is totally fine, but that's life. 900 damage. We got him. He's toast. Bada bing, bada boom. Perfecto mundissimo. We're getting pretty low on health, but, um, <clears throat> Yeah, I'm just gonna keep gambling it. <laughs> Face also grand it. Okay. Heal lost health. Deal three times the amount recovered. Um, I'm just gonna go for the light shaft potion. Because now I should have a lot of things going on here for us. So hopefully it all pans out. And yes, we're taking damage. That was interesting. Did we hit a bomb? I don't know if we hit a bomb. I feel like we didn't. Okay. So we definitely probably want as much as we can take here. We don't want the basic blade because we're kind of already going for a crit build in some ways. In some ways we're not, but I mean, with the duplication potion and, uh, well, I mean, with the light shaft potion, with those two items, I mean, we're kind of going for a crit build. So we're going to say no to this. We can probably get stuff for the sling, but is there another shop? There is another shop. So we'll save our money instead. We'll get the decoy orb and the strange brew. Those will be our two our two go-tos so we can save a little bit of money and hope, hope that we get something a little bit nicer here in the near future. Alrighty. Oh man, I am excited. Uh, but anyways, yeah, sorry, going back to my day. So yeah, um, if you guys have any suggestions on, you know, how to shake, how to shake any, any feelings of, uh, um, slowing down or whatever, let me know, leave a comment. I'm always curious to hear, hear and see what you guys got. 500 damage. Okay, this is actually a pretty scary fight. Um, this actually really is a pretty scary fight. Good news is we got a crit. Bad news is we're going to be pretty low on health. I definitely have to heal here. Luckily, we're killing him here unless we die first, which is a possibility. Uh, let's definitely heal. We have to heal. There's just no way, no way around it. We have to heal. Uh, I think we go for the heavy shaft potion. So we just have the board refresh as much as possible. Now we're gonna go left if we can. Uh, we're just gonna wait for things to kind of clear up a little bit here. Yes, no. <laughs> I trolled myself. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I got it. I didn't. I didn't get it. The spoiler alert. I didn't get it. Oh my word. Okay. 
Okay, we got it. We're just gonna slow it down a little bit so I can make that shot a little bit better. It, it didn't work. Well, I guess I'm going right. Uh, well, that's all right. That is okay. We're lucky. Maybe we still go left. Um, uh, increase my health by 15. Sounds pretty good. We can still go right and get an item. We also might, by chance, might get uh, the passage event. Nope, no passage event. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna go left here because the left seems to have uh, possibilities of something good, which I'm all about. Fortunately, we didn't end up going left. We ended up going right. That's okay. <laughs> that's okay. Let's we'll cry about it a little bit later and pretend everything's fine. There we go. Oh, he got stuck. Uh, that's one of the first times I've ever seen that happen. Um, that orb basically never gets stuck. Oh, I was hoping I could maybe sneak it in the middle there. At least we got a crit. That shield is dead. Toasterino, cappuccino. There's some health. And we're skipping the Kobanord. I mean, the swashbuckle orb. Um, just because we don't really want to use it. I'm using it just for posterity's sake, more or less. So... Let's not worry about it too much. Let's go and heal up and uh, we can go and upgrade this to max. There we go. There we go. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. We're all good to go. Also, thank you guys so much for the challenges and all sorts of things. I really appreciate it. Um, I have a lot of fun doing all these challenges. And uh, now that I've kind of like made it a little bit more loosey goosey for myself, um, I have a lot more fun with it because I can change it up just a little bit, make it a little bit more amiable. A little bit more doable in some situations because I know that um, I know that you guys are sending me these uh, challenges with the idea that uh, what's it called you want to see them tried uh, you know you want to see how they see if they pan out or not not necessarily to, to um, show off something you've already done yourself so I think it's pretty oh what is our oh, okay oh, yeah well, this is good I healed I definitely need to be healing um, <clears throat> But yeah, so, you know, I totally understand that you guys aren't really trying these yourself necessarily, but you just have this idea that sounds like it could be awesome. And that being said, I mean, I'm, I'm all about awesome ideas. I love trying things out and I love seeing if they'll work. Wow. That was impressive. That's, I honestly, that's all I've got to say. That's all I've got to say. The Terrible did something that surprised me and impressed me thoroughly and greatly. So... Hey. Okay, I'm glad it finally shoved itself through because that would have been horrible if it kept staying up there. <laughs> that was, uh, it could have been bad. Needless to say, it could have been bad. Let's go hard right here and hope that we just get a refresh and it just continues on with life. There we go. The crits are a little bit scary here. Alrighty. Yeah, we're giving ourselves lots of damage. I'm gonna go skip that really quick. Uh, let's see if we can do it again, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> it's one of those weird ones. Okay, he's toast, which is good. Honestly, getting a lot of refreshes is really good. I actually don't know if the crit refreshes were healing me or not, but I hope they were. I don't definitely don't feel like my health really took any big hit from that, so kind of okay with that. Criticris would be mad damage. We would be doing tons of damage. So something that actually came to my mind... Um, in one of the previous videos is we're talking about how the Criticris is uh, not as good as the Molten Mantle because the Molten Mantle does damage to your single target with your max damage, which can be a lot of damage. But Criticris isn't as far behind as you might think because it does it deals your orbs damage, orbs crit damage to all the enemies, which is something I think is really impressive. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab it here because I, I definitely just want it. That's more than more than anything I just want it. Um, but yeah, so it's not as far behind. Don't get me wrong, Molten Mantle's still far superior, still far stronger. But um, you know, just something to something to think about. You know, it's not quite as far behind as you might think. Wow, that was unfortunate. Getting stuck so much. So this is actually going to be a little bit of a struggle bus. Um, if they keep getting stuck like that, yeah, it's going to be a little bit of a struggle bus. I definitely wanted to go for the refreshes because the refreshes actually help me heal. So, you know, it's kind of nice to have a little bit of healing. We're going to go and skip that because, again, that's not our dealio. Let's see. Okay, so every time it does hit a crit and refresh the board, it actually does heal me. So, yeah, that's amazing. We actually get quite a bit of healing off that. Um, I'm glad we didn't get stuck that time because that would have been atrocious. 
There we go. There we go. Come on, keep hitting. No, it got stuck. It's really interesting that it gets stuck sometimes like that. You know, I'm a little bit surprised in some situations. I really hope that there's eventually um, an orb or relic or something that makes those bombs that get activated. I really hope that there's something that fills in those empty spaces. I think that'd be a really cool thing. Okay, so we didn't really get anything too amazing here. That being said, I'm kind of tempted to take Sealed Conviction. That's what I was going to grab before. But that also means that I'll have to take that I'll have to use a Swashbuckle Orb. Um, which I'm okay with. I'm okay with using Swashbuckle Orb. It's kind of a little bit adjacent to the challenge because obviously, you know, it's going to be it's going to be a little bit adjusted, but let's go and take it. Let's go and take it. Yeah. We'll take Sealed Conviction here. Like I said, nothing else was really that amazing. I don't want to be I don't want to be confused. Um I have to try really, really hard to like hit the right shots when I have confusion and it just doesn't, it's not as fun. <laughs> it's not as fun for me. So, uh, you know, try to, try to not do that, you know? Okay. Let's see if we get 700 damage. I think we'll be able to. Oh yeah. Easy peasy. We healed up a little bit too. So that works out pretty nicely. Let's go ahead and start upgrading this all the way because at this point it's going to be worth it. So we probably want to go down this route here, the uh, middle or middle right or right left one. I don't know how you want to call it just because there's a shop and an elite fight. The far left one here, it does have a lot of potential, but uh, I think it's better to go for an elite fight, like a guaranteed elite fight. So we can definitely go for at least two things. Um, we have a lot of time, though. So let's go and just continue on. Whenever I get the opportunity, I'll probably be healing up a little bit just because I think it's going to be important to. So we'll just kind of do it like that. I can't skip this. As you can see, I can't skip it. Um, so let's go ahead and just do this. This should be pretty crazy. Should be pretty bonkers because all the damage we all the extra damage we're going to get from the coins. Could you be an additional two times damage? Yeah, see, I'm surprised uh, it didn't die. I'm surprised it didn't die actually i'm actually really happy that we ended up not dying i mean uh the orb the swashbuckle orb targets a single target specifically i'm happy about that because uh, what would have ended up happening if it didn't is we would have been in kind of some big trouble um yeah kind of some big trouble okay if we go to the right side we probably want to go to the right boss right elite rather than the left elite so we'll go hard right here uh, ooh, yeah, okay, so this kind of works and it kind of doesn't. Here's why, here's why it works and here's why it doesn't. It works because it helps heal us. We do have a couple other healing things like the cookie and the well done steak, so this technically should be okay. However, having so little health um, poses a really big risk. That really big risk is, let's say one of these elite fights is the, uh, is the blind fight. This doesn't work again in the blind fight. So if this doesn't work in the blind fight and we have a blind fight, then we probably die. Um, so I think what we're going to end up doing is I think we're just going to skip it as much as I want it. Um, I just can't really convince myself that that's a good option. <laughs> I really can't. Okay. Okay. There we go. I think we're going to be okay. I think we're going to make it all the way to the right. There we go. Perfect. Oh, alrighty. We'll see if uh, we'll see if my fears come into fruition or not. If they didn't, well then you know, um, I probably could have taken it and been completely fine. But if they do, then obviously I was right to be worried and uh, made the right decisions. At least for right now, this wasn't. Uh, my fears have not come into fruition. This is really just not. Wouldn't have mattered. At least for right now. And yeah, I don't really care who it who it hits or how it hits them. Ooh, wow, it's so big it actually gets stuck on that. Interesting. Ooh, that's unfortunate. I wanted it to go right, not left, but that's okay. Let's see. Let's see if we can just bounce it off to the right. Okay. Well, that's something. That's something more than nothing. There we go. Alrighty. Get in there. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right. There's the crit we wanted. I like how I like how this orb gets stuck on things. It's really funny. All right, he's definitely toast, especially with that red bomb. 
He's definitely toast. There's no way. I feel like he didn't get stuck on that red bomb previously. I could be wrong. Kobanord. Okay, we're going to go and heal up a little bit because we just need to. There's the Overwhammer. I do like the idea of the Overwhammer quite a bit. Also, Ring of Indignation would give me a bunch of extra damage because would be constantly dealing like four times damage. It'd kind of be like a pseudo mental mantle. Um, Overwhammer doesn't help us that much. So I'm kind of feeling like the Ring of Indignation is the way to go. I know Refreshing Punch is pretty awesome, but equally, actually, I have questions. So I'm going to take the, I'm going to take this. So if you guys don't know, um, we have the duplication potion, which puts a lot of uh, refresh pegs on the board. Now, something that I'm interested in seeing, ooh, that's gonna be really good. Something I'm interested in seeing is, does the duplication potion, oh no, please. Okay, whew. Uh, does the duplication potion affect how, uh, um, I mean, does the, all the refreshes, can they chain react? That's what, I'm, that's what I'm curious about. I'm curious if they can chain react. I imagine they can. Nice. I imagine they can. I just don't really know for sure. So, you know, curiosity kills the cat, I guess, is, is what it boils down to. Alrighty. We should be doing a bunch of damage. Yeah, we should be dealing mad damage with our crits. So, not that concerned. There we go. Alrighty. Hopefully, he goes left. Actually, it doesn't really matter. He's dead anyways, so... Whatever direction is totally fine with me. Alrighty. Um, I could heal, but I think I'm okay for the moment. So I think what I'll do is I'll just not heal. And, uh, ooh, popping corn. There we go. So now our damage, I mean, now we're fine. Now we should be fine. Now there's nothing to worry about. We should be able to heal up enough between the cookie, the popping corn, and the well-done steak. We should be able to heal up enough that we're good. I really like sand arrows. Um, it's really just a preference for, of mine. I really like them. And, uh, you know, it's just a lucky thing. Lucky thing? Kind of lucky thing. Okay, we don't really care about the bombs. Bad cheese is cool. So, the only thing we're, we really don't want is the dumbbell. Um, the dumbbell's a no-go. So, we're going to take pocket sand. We're going to take the bad cheese. And we're going to take the bombulet. Cool beans. That's how much money we had. We could only get three items, so that's what we ended up getting. And there you go. My fears would have been um, realized. So I'm really happy that I ended up doing this because, again, this would have been horrible if I was unable to deal any damage um, or heal rather properly in a situation like this. So I'm really happy that it panned out the way it has. Because, like I said, I would have I would have been in a bad situation. However, if you just notice, the Criticris actually is dealing damage to all the blinded enemies. All the invisible enemies. That's actually really insane. That's actually really, really insane. And the reason why that's so insane is because most damage types that um, target enemies, like, for example, the Swashbuckle Orb, it cannot hit those invisible enemies. And so, seeing an orb that can do that is actually really really crazy also we're getting mad damage we're getting mad damage sir can we like can we like continue on please uh you've been there for a while boldorb i appreciate the enthusiasm but it's time to go down it's time to have a good time time to have a good time and get down also if you guys enjoy this kind of content consider subscribing to the channel i make a lot of peglin videos and probably will keep making a lot of peglin videos moving forward um yeah, let's go and heal up. I don't really have anything that I'm like keeping my money for now. Intentional Oboe is the ticket here. I know you guys are probably thinking, oh, Lucky Penny sounds great or Wall Chicken maybe. Probably Lucky Penny because that's going to be like maybe more damage. But Intentional Oboe, just so we have no worries. Now we have zero worries in the world about our health. We will always be healing up and not, not dying from the... Uh, from the, uh, what's it called? Wanda Sculptimate Power. That's a really important thing here, is just taking as much as we can. Whoops. Uh, taking as much as we can, just making sure we're, we're okay. That's the biggest thing. Now that we have that and we're good, there's nothing to worry about. We're all solid, we're all set in stone. 
Alrighty, perfect, beautiful. Nice. Yeah, see, so now I don't have to worry about my health, so I can just kind of keep my money and stuff. Okay, grab all the all the monies just in case. I don't, you know, you never know what you're gonna run into. You might run into something special, fancy. We have a question mark, you know. So there might be something. There might be. Alrighty, I'm interested to see how this goes. I mean, I'm only gonna kill one thing, and uh, I don't have to worry about killing anything else or hurting anything else. So we're fine. Yep, that guy was Toast Arena. Let's go hard right. Hopefully, if I can, I'll get a crit somewhere somehow. There we go. Just like that. That's exactly what I was looking for. Wow, he just zipped his way down to the bottom. I like that. I also think it's funny. There we go. And we're good. I mean, there's nothing to worry about, really. Let's see if we can just... Kind of, we're going to have to kind of brute force our way through here, though. Because there is just way too much... Way too much that I have to... That I have to hit to get my way down there. Come on now. There we go. Yeah, we didn't clear out that middle area too much. Wow, we got an extra item. Um, to be honest, gears backpacks not gonna really help us. So we're gonna go for the safety net. Unfortunately, those were like, what's a bad item and like what's a moderately okay item. That's basically what that all boiled down to. So yeah, a little bit unfortunate there, but that's okay. So this is really good. Um, we're actually doing quite a bit of uh, damage already. We might be able to one-shot him. I have no idea. I'm interested to see. I don't think we're going to be able to. I don't think it's going to happen. But you never know. It might happen. There's always that slim possibility, you know? Slim pickings. Nope, no one-shot there. That's okay. He didn't deal any damage to us because we didn't hit any red bombs, which is really good. We're going to hit a red bomb here, though, I think. I'm surprised we haven't yet. Okay, still no red bomb action. That's totally fine. So yeah, he still can't deal damage to us. Um, especially because we have the intentional oboe. He will definitely deal damage now though, I think. Because now we have two red bombs. So maybe he will, maybe he won't. Maybe I'm just uh, blind still. Please get a crit because we're doing 15 damage. Nope, okay. 15 times the damage. That's fine. Well, this is definitely a really good spot over here because there's done tons of crits and things over there on the left side. So, I mean, we, we better be. We better be hitting that. Alrighty. Ooh, he's close. He's close. This used to be a really scary boss. Um, but now, I mean, we just kind of force our way in, into it and make it work out. So I was like, okay, well, you force yourself to do it. It, it is what it is. And there we go, guys. Bada bing, bada boom. We have won. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. And not only that, guys, go check the description. Go check out Cam Wen. Help him get over that 1,000 um, subscriber mark. He helped me out in the past. And like I said, was trying to pay it forward. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed and catch you guys in the next one. Peace out, everybody. And adios.